So today I feel like speaking like this, which is my um, a really bad Hugh Grant imitation accent. So if I have to do an English accent now, this is the way I like to speak. So you're just going to have to pretend that I have a wee devilish twinkle in my eye and I'm irresistible to women. Now, uh, there's this perception in the English speaking world that isn't Britain that this is the way that Brits speak and so <laughs> here in Canada I can get away with this as an English accent and it was uh, a bit of a bugbear really the whole time I was in London that I, I didn't really feel confident going up for any acting roles that required a British accent because well I didn't think I could really pass myself off that way because um, you know this, this isn't the way that Brits actually speak and so I'd have to try something else, which would make me sound rather like a tit. Um, however, uh, where am I going with this? Oh yes, well, the reason I'm thinking about accents is that uh, I, I met up with a talent agent today, and I, you know, someone whose books I want to be on, and I thought, well, uh, I, I don't really know that now I can pass myself off as Canadian, so <laughs> I was trying to think of who else I could be, and I was like, well, I could be Australian, oh, I could be a New Zealander. Uh, I could be this. I could be a, a bad Hugh Grant impersonator. Um, <laughs> so uh, there you go. That's my whole uh, catalogue and range. Um, something else to think about is that uh, I filled in two censuses this year. How many of you filled out?